Okay, let's begin part 7, chapter 16, post fix fact up mail server. And chapter 17, I will show you how to set up the post fix admin with MySQL. Chapter 16, post fix the backup mail server. Normally, if the primary mail server starts, then the email will not arrive this uh, user's mailbox. So in this case, we need to configure the backup mail server. So in this case, the primary mail server is uh, shut down. In this case, the, this mail will arrive to the backup mail server, especially mail queue. And uh, if the primary mail server is working well, as uh, normally, then this mail server save in the mail queue of the backup mail server will transfer to the primary mail host. So now in this video, I will show you how to set up this the backup mail server using first fix. First one, number one. In the DNS server, we have to configure like this. First one. In my case, I'm using now the DNS uh, domain name, the chal.com. So in this case, there are two the mail sub ms1 chal.com ms2 chal.com and uh, this one the prior to 10 this one is a uh, prior to 20 so prior to 10 means this is a uh, primary mail server primary 20 means this is a uh, backup mail server and uh, this uh, mail host has this kind of ip address so using this command press check this information and the uh, number two in the backup server in my case, the ms2.chal.com. So here we need to configure like this hostname ms2chal.com, domainchal.com, and uh, interface all the destination ms2.chal.com and the network address like this. So here we have to configure this kind of two file relay domains. So here it is the first fix relay domains and the transport the maps. So first fix transport like this. Using this uh, two file, we will create the hash file to save the information including the virtual domains and of that the relay recipient maps must be the blank and as a SMTP recipient restriction so like a permit SARS authentication permit the network address but the unauthorized destination will be rejected Okay, and after that, we have to configure the relay domains create. So first, you don't find this one, so you have to create like this. In my case, I have a three domain to the relay. First one, the child.com, jung.com, and news.com. So here, okay. And after that, transport file, child.com, jung.com, news.com. So I will configure like this, SMTP, using this uh, mail server and port number 25 will be this one, transport. And after that, we have to create the database file using this command post map, uh, delay domains and transport. And after that, we have to start first fix. Testing, first fix server in the primary mail server stop. And after that, in the backup mail server, using the, this command, the backup server, uh, try to send the email to the itchl.com, liachong.com, park at list.com. So this is three domain. This one, so will be tested. And after that, the post queue. If you want to, see, maybe now the primary mail is shut down, so this one cannot the, accept this email. So this email will be saved to the mail queue. So using this command, post queue hyphen queue, you can see the queue mail. And after, if you want to send this email, the forcibly, then you can use hyphen app. Okay, then let's test here. Okay, first let's check the DNS first. In my case, okay. Uh, so in my case, I'm using the names of this one and the mail server like this: ms one chal.com priority five, ms two chal.com priority ten. So this one will be the primary mail sub and ms2 will be backup mail sub and also has this IP address. And after that, if we click, if we use this command, chal.com, this one mail server about this domain, 
Mutual.com has two main servers, and this one and IP address like this. Okay, and after that, uh, in the client part, okay, let's check the this one in the client. I'm staying here, so here, let's uh, open main.cf. So let's check here so informations. First one, now in my case, uh, hostname ms2.chal.com, domain chal.com, and the origin, the interface, and the protocol, and the uh, destination hostname, and network style, and my network address. And the, the most important part here, List peer restrictions, the permitted network, SASL, and authorized destination can be the rejected. And the delay domain here, delay domains, and transport maps like this. Okay, and after that, uh, so line number 336, delay list peer maps must be blank like this. Okay, then now uh, ms2.com is a uh, uh, with the complete and after that let's uh, check the relay domains so in my case the three domains chal.com jung.com linux.com and uh, transport also this one chal.com like this and the jung.com will be transported using this one ms1.chal.com port number 25 like this okay and after that the first uh, map Delay domains and after that uh, transport. Then we can find so here okay delay domain and delay do domains dot db transport and transport dot db. So using this one we can create the database file. Okay, now let's test in the server part. First, let's uh, shut down service first fix stop. Okay, now in the client part, let's uh, test. Okay, so here, uh, let's uh, try to send the three the uh, receivers. Okay, like this. S. First will be the username, char.com, and the content will be etc password. Okay, and after that, here, let's uh, Okay, and after that Again, and the user now will be changed to Lee Jong.com So, and after that Now the last user, Park this one, the domain will be linux.com and after that, password. So in the mail log, we can find the here, park, and uh, this one, where is, okay, Lee, and after that, uh, leejong.com and itcchol.com. And almost thing, false to Q, hyphen p so now we can find the q file itc chart.com park linux and the region so here let f then here we can find connection refuse because now ms1 chart.com shut down okay now then the in the primary let's start the first fix my server again Okay, and after that, here, let's try to use now P, we can find three Q file, but F, then we can see here, removed. So, P, so mail key is empty. Okay, then let's go back to the server part. So let's uh, try to check the email. So ITC received the email, root to client char, and the sender root to client and receive ITC and uh, the subject the backup and content ETC password. 
Okay, how about the Lee and Park? Okay, in the suburb. Okay. Home. So here. Okay, let's click uh, read five six. So here, this file arrived. Uh, okay, sender the root client and the receiver lejong.com and the subject by the mail here you can find the client SMTP and the content etc password okay one more home park mail new okay let's read okay this one also now the sender root from the client and the receiver park linux.com and the subject back a mail claim smtp and content etc password so the these three user receiving the email from the uh, backup mail server so now we check that the backup mail server is working well okay chapter 17 first fix admin with mysql so what is the first fix admin? This is a supply to configure first fix on web-based GUI. So to use a first fix admin, we the web server and database server are also necessary to be installed. So we will use the Apache as a web server, MySQL as a database server. Number two, download and install package. First, we have to create the database and the user for first fix admin. So create database of first of admin and uh, privileges to this uh, database. This is your first fix admin and the password. And after that, we have to the configure the, this first fix admin package. To use this one, we have to install PHP MySQL and PHP IMAP. And please download this package from this website. The, so recently, the latest version 2.3.6 so x extract this one and then move this one to apache web directory ww slash html postfix admin like this and after we need to configure here config.ins.php so here we must be the change to true from the purse and the language and the database user first fix admin and password database name like this and also we have to create this file first fix admin conf to be used by apache so only five line and here we have to configure access list in my case that will the permit to the access from this network and after that the first fix admin access first fix admin set up so here First, uh, click the lost password, and here, if you uh, input the set password and generate the password hash, this one must be the paste to this file, config.ina.php. In my case, the line number 31. Come for set password like this. And after that, web server start, and uh, he, now you are ready to create the admin and password using this one we can access this uh, url then after successful to login to the admin then we can uh, test first one i will try to create the virtual domain jong.com and linux.com and the virtual users like this and have that try to send email okay then the Okay, first let's try to configure the database first. Okay, first create database first fix admin. Okay, and after that, uh, grant all post fix on the First fix admin that to user first fix admin and the core 
host and id e-n-t-i-f-i-e identify password okay password admin just okay okay then okay and after that cute okay and after that uh, let's check the package okay and after that imap as well okay and after that download the package in my case I already download uh, so let's go so here so tar xvjf first fix so not move here mv first fix first fix admin just okay and after that config so yeah, let's configure here first one line number 26 so here must be changed to true and uh, set a password later and the uh, language in my case i will use the english so here line number 49 so the database type mysql and the uh, host local host the user first picks uh, okay here admin and the password only admin and the uh, database name first picks admin okay after that Okay, uh, admin email here, I will change this one. Okay, tland in my case, char.com, like this. And the SMTP, okay. Okay, let's finish here. Okay, and after that, the service, ah, okay, uh, etc, httpd, D here, please open the first fix admin so like this br w.html first fix admin and allow from only this network okay and after that service http restart okay now let's try to use the browser here okay so localhost first fix admin Okay, not login. Set up. So please here, if you have some errors, so here you can find some error, but in my case now it's okay. So first one, set a password. Okay, I will only use admin. Admin, and after that, uh, generate the password hash. So now I found this hash code. So using this one, copy, and after that, so here let's go back to the setup password. Okay, line number 31. So here, let's delete the uh, change me. And after that, here, faced. Okay. Now. Okay, now again. So now set a password, in my case, admin. And the admin, uh, email address in my case I will use this one and the password admin admin like this add so now we, I can see this one admin has been added so tlanchar.com so in this case now let's try to login here login.php so in my case uh, username the tland com and the password admin 
Okay, now I uh, successful to log in to the Postmix admin. So here, let's test the first one, domain list. So in my case, now domain list, I don't have. So here, let's try to create a new domain. So domain first, jong.com and uh, jong domain. Okay, add. And one more, linux.com linux domain like this okay the add so now let's check the domain list okay john.com and linux.com and have the virtual list here now i don't have so here let's try to mailbox so linux.com linux.com park username and the password okay here park1234 and park1234 Okay, name just park here. Okay, then add. Ah, okay, sorry, the password park1234 and park1234. Okay. Okay, now one more user. Uh, Jung.com here. The user will be Lee and the password. Li1234 and Li1234. Just Li. Okay, create. So now the let's click here. Linux.com park and Jung.com Li. And then here try to send email. So the user will be Li. Jong.com. Okay, welcome message. Okay, and the uh, park linux.com as well. This one, welcome message. Let's just click the view log. So here, Jong.com, the user, the admin, okay, send, and the, the other, okay, linux.com as well, till end, the domain. This one create like this. Okay, then the let's check the email Linux uh, Lee and the Park. Okay, home Lee mail directory due. Okay, here. Okay, cat the latest one. Six five three. Okay, so here the receiver lejong.com and the sender tlandchal.com subject welcome and welcome message like this. And one more user home park mail and due. Okay, let's check. One five six five and three. Okay, this one also the receiver parknews.com and sender the subject and the text like this. And one more testing. Now the I am the successful to create the virtual domain and virtual users on the first fix admin on using the GUI. And then how about the database? Okay, root. Okay, and after that, the use first fix admin show tables. So I have the, this kind of table. Okay, here, here. Let's uh, check, for example, aliases. Okay, now I can find two, sparknews.com and the leejong.com. Okay, and uh, how about the domain? So here also there are two, so jong.com, jong domain, and linux.com, linux domain, like this. So, so far I show you how to set up the first piece of admin with the mask, with the, this kind of testing. 
Okay, so far I the explain the post pics as a baseball, and uh, in the part one I explain the, about the MTA post pics, how to install post pics, and how to configure as well. And the part two I explain the IMAP and pops using Dovecot. And uh, Evolution Thunderbird Microsoft Outlook 2010 as a MTA on client. Part 3, Postfix LSS and Access Control. And Part 4, Mailman as a mailing list, Square Mail as a, the web mail, and Mail Graph as well. And Part 5, Postfix Authentication using the SASL and TLS. And Part 6, uh, post be anti spam antivirus with the spam assassin and amabis and clam antivirus as well. In the last uh, the video, I explained the post base for backup, mail server, and the post base admin using my SQL. Okay, thank you for watching my video so far, and uh, see you next video. God bless you.